It's no secret New Mexico is fighting a drug problem, but the way one local woman is bringing attention to the issue is garnering a lot of attention. In fact, it's gone viral. News 13's Lizzie Mitri shows us what started as a class project is now becoming an Albuquerque woman's mission. More than 5,300 views in just five days, giving the world a glimpse of Albuquerque. The beautiful view from the Sandias, the sounds of traffic rushing through Central. But this YouTube hit is also revealing a dark secret in New Mexico, told through the eyes of a UNM student. Her brother died at 23 of a heroin overdose. Calling my dad after that was the hardest part. Having to tell him that his son, just after his wife had passed away, was gone too. It was so tough. Kendra Crook spent three months collecting interviews for the film, Chasing the Dragon, named after a technique used to smoke heroin. It started as a class project. Crooks talked to other New Mexicans who've lost family members to drug overdoses and even recovering addicts. It really is hard to describe it. Uh, your whole body just warms. It's, oh my God. This woman told Crooks about a friend she was trying to get off drugs. October 24th, the day that I interviewed with Kendra, Three hours later, my best friend overdosed from heroin. Crooks never expected to get this much attention, and now that she's got it, she's not stopping anytime soon. What I really want to do is have people start to talk about it, and people are, you know, people in high schools, um, parents. While thousands have seen her message on YouTube, she's now taking the message to Albuquerque high schools and talking about the drug that killed her brother. The amount of impact it's had already is so awesome and if people keep spreading it and people keep learning about the dangers of heroin then I think it will really make a difference. Liz Amy Tree, KRQE News 13. And Crook says the video has received so many hits YouTube contacted her today offering payment. Now you know